Another one here. Hmm. The giant's a sorceress. Her name is Groa. Looks like she's she a Groa, not a Showa. Did Odin kill her for her book? How are you here before us, dwarf? We were told our path was the only one between realms. Well, it may be the only way for you to travel, but we dwarves are full of surprises. That is not an answer. Ah, hang on to that sense of wonder. There's so little mystery once you've amassed the wealth of arcane knowledge that I have. Where to comb the realms for exotic resources. How to craft them into creations that defy imagination. To the novice, I'm sure it all seems like magic, but... Uh... Oh, all right. It's magic. Are you happy now? <laughs> no. Did you really make that axe for my mother? Oh, I'd recognize it anywhere. Ask me. It's one of our best. Infused with the echoing screams of 20 frost trolls. Give or take. But why her? How did you know her? She sought us out in the beginning. She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. I suppose we thought it was a chance to give power to someone who'd use it for good. Hmm. She even spoke our native tongue. She'd say, Madhurin Sem Gengur, Egen Vigum Hans. Gengur I. That's right. That's impressive. I see a lot of her in your eyes. You know? Thanks, and Don't I... touch me. What? I didn't. I won't. I'll come back later. Be careful where you're going. There's nobody nice out here anymore since all the people left. I mean, I hate to generalize, but um, mostly they just try to kill you. Good tip. <laughs> um, I know it's not my business, but if I were you, I'd wash off that symbol painted on your neck. We were told it would help protect us. Was that a lie? Oh, no, it's a protection stave, all right. But you can't render that pigment into paintable texture without blending it with boar urine. And is that really better than death? Maybe a little. Well, well, it's your neck. <laughs> Sindri, have you always been so... Clean? Huh. Don't I wish. No, I was just as unsanitary as the next dwarf until the day a Vanir witch set me straight. She discovered with her magic there are hundreds of thousands of tiny beasties on everything around us. Ugh, so small you can't even see them. No. It's true. And if they get inside you, they make you sick. But the witch told me there's one wood, the oak, that's a natural deterrent. Stops the beasties from spreading. So now, I make all my handles from oak. See? I think of these things. Okay, back to work. So how come Brock's blue and you're not? Boy. Oh, it's fine. Very good question, actually. You see, my brother's not as careful as I am. In fact, <laughs> he prefers to work with metals using... Oh, his own bare hands. Ugh. No gloves. Says it's the only way he can hear what it wants to be. Touch enough raw silver and it changes your skin irreparably. That means forever. I wouldn't bring it up to him, though. <laughs> you know how sensitive he can be. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> Sindri, why don't you just make up with your brother already? Me? Make up with him? Yeah. Because the boy he's an said. obstinate pighead incapable of change. Because he says the most terrible things about me. Just because he's insecure about his own work. Which, let me tell you, is subpar. Because he blames me for... For the things that aren't my fault. Huh? Like what? <sighs> Would you pardon me, please? I need to collect myself. Mm, no more, no more, uh... Voice options, gotcha. Let me hit your shot though. Ready and ready. Chest armor. Pauldron of the Ancients. Ooh, hello. Daddy likey. Oh, look at that beast shit. Do 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 do. Ooh. 
Oh, I that. Who knew? Yes, dear boy. Just look around and see if there's anything new. Upgrade. Nope. What nope. Nope. Wait. No. No. Ooh, I can upgrade my wolf skin bracers. That's pretty dope. I think that's a keeper. Hell yeah. Eight waste axe twistman. All right, anything to sell? No. Okay, should be good here. Was there more to discuss? Uh, no. I think we've said all we needed to say. Appreciate your time, Sindri. This way. Come, boy. <laughs> Ew. Anyway. We're inside. Of course. Let's party, boys. Come on, Atreus, you fucking kill stealer. That so bad. That's not cool. Just gonna totally run up on him and fuck him up. But then you fucked up my chances of fucking him up. Disappointing. Oh, no, okay. I wonder what those are attached to. Almost! Nice. Fuck him up. Alright, what's in the chest? What did I unlock? What's so special? Some soft zwart film steel. Hey. Suicide bombers, gotcha. Didn't realize that aspect of it. Whoa! Now that's impressive. Dude, I just broke a pot. What are you talking about? That's not impressive. Everyone does that. Read it. From darkness. Keep safe the light. Didn't do a very good job, did they? Lol. Ah, uh, but what's over here though? Oh, nothing. Just random little side area. We. Wait, is there one behind it? Yep, line it up. 
Line it up. Gotcha. Okay, so what good did that do me? Did did that actually help with anything? Sure doesn't look like it. Oh, what, what do you think you're doing going ahead of me, boy? What do you think you're doing, boy? <laughs> to the right, to the right, to the right, to the right. There, the light. They've covered it up with that stuff. How would they do that? Because they're assholes. Look. Another light up. What's he doing? Oh no. Why are they killing him? Because they're doing? assholes. Do not assume. You are seeing the end of a war, boy. You do not know what led to this moment. But he didn't even defend himself. That was his choice. We make ours. Go! I held the aim button expecting the block. That was a very bad idea. Nope. <laughs> He's gonna summon more dudes. Chopped his balls off. The light is near. Look for a way inside. When in doubt, chop your enemy's balls off. Castration, the best method. Ah, here we go. Now open the fuck up, thank you kindly. That did it! Look! More light bridges! Oh yay! Follow me. More light bridges. I'm so excited. Nightmare! Wrong button. You need not worry about me, child. Oh fuck, a two for one, that's what I'm talking Glad about. That's over. 